2007 Formula 45 electronics. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the radar on and hit transmit, clear, and uh, should be going any second now. There's the radar. Engine hours are roughly 889. All the gauges work. IPS drive, I'll go ahead and engage that. And we have forward, we have reverse, we have left, and right. 2007 Formula 45. This is a video. The engines are running. The generator is running. Service on the engines and the generator were just performed four months ago. IPS service was also done about four months ago. Two thousand seven Formula Forty Five. I'm going to go ahead and lower the engine hatch all the way. Still operates properly, both up and down position. Two thousand seven Formula Forty Five. I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate the swim platform. I'm powering it down now. One hundred percent functions. Goes all the way into the water. I'm gonna go ahead and raise it now. Also has both remotes with the. Uh, powered swim platform. Two thousand seven Formula forty five. I'm going to give you a brief tour of the interior of the boat. Fire damage to the seats in the back of the boat. We'll go ahead and enter the cabin. Cabin is 100%, zero damage. In that area, manuals of the boat. Come to the master bedroom. Master bath. Sinks, toilets, exhaust fan, still operational. Main shower, 
all 100% in perfect working condition. Back bedroom, all perfect. For some reason, the carbon dioxide alarm is going off. I'm sure that has to do with the, maybe the low batteries. House batteries, engine batteries, generator batteries are less than two years old, still in 100% working condition. Here's a 2007 Formula 45 fire damage. Top radar is melted, but actually still works. The decking still looks good. A little bubbled on the side of the fire. The actual power cord is melted towards the end, but the motor and the controls uh, still work 100% perfect. As we come to the fireside damage, fiberglass, of course, is all flaked off. Windows are gone. Close up of the top. Front speakers are melted. The center glass hatch is still functionable and the glass is still intact. Close up of the actual damage to the gel coat. And then down below the rub rail. And of course the top deck damage front of the boat, front cushions both burned up in the fire. Currently the generator is functioning due to the power cord having a burnt in. Also air conditioners still work fine both inside the cabin and the 30,000 BTU air conditioner and the cockpit still works fine. Here's the good side of the boat. I would say this is 100% perfect on this side of the boat. And the majority of the deck is also in good condition. Hatch is burned up and Starboard side of the glass is still intact, both the front windshield and the sides.